Hello everybody and welcome to your first 100% online hybrid course that you didn't expect to be enrolled in. Um, by now you should all be recovering from the in-class midterm on Friday and getting ready to look at essay 3. So if you look at the attached email or click on your syllabus, um, you'll be able to see the assignments that you need to be doing for this week. The only thing that is due tonight is the discussion questions. Um, the hacker questions have already been posted onto Canvas and I will be getting the they say, I say questions up soon as um, the student, unfortunately, who was supposed to be doing the discussion questions tonight has dropped. Um, looking forward to the next few days, the only assignment that is gonna be happening is by Friday the 20th, you should be looking at the instructions for SA3 um, on technology, and we are looking at a new structure for our essay. Also, Grammar 2 is due on Canvas, and I'm gonna be preparing a separate lecture for a PDF for the Grammar 2 corrections if you need to review that. And also, um, we should start taking a look at taking notes um, of our essays, um, looking forward to our research paper, Essay 5, um, and looking at the notes that you were using for your um, research proposal. Um, you want to start reading those articles and starting to take notes on them, um, doing quotes, summaries, and paraphrases. So I will be um, making a different, very short, no more than two minute YouTube video so that you don't get to that too long, didn't watch. Um, point, um, but we do want to take a quick look at some of the changes for SA3. So let's take a quick look at the instructions. I'm just going to log in on Canvas and go into our class and pull up the instructions for SA3. Um, as you look at SA3's instructions, um, you will notice that there is a few little differences right here. Um, so what we're going to keep doing is the same thing as before, examining the widely held belief but now what we're doing is looking at a solution to a problem. Um, you can see here, right, um, what we're not doing anymore is a position. We're saying, how do we fix this problem? And it's looking directly at social media. Um, otherwise, the structure of the essays, essay is gonna be the same, your introduction, the hook, the summaries, which can be background, history, definitions. At this point, some people like to give history or a definition of the problem, but also look at definitions for the solution because sometimes terms um, that are used for the solution are jargon and they don't really make sense. And then you'll state your thesis, right? Um, what is the solution to this problem? And then your four supports. And here um, you're explaining um, what you're responding to, right? Um, four reasons this solution will work, not four different solutions. So one solution, four reasons. And then of course, um, you want to look at objections and refutations, um, you know, objections you're responding to, that you're predicting someone will disagree with your solution or the reasons for your solution. Um, and um, refuting those objections. But also you can, instead of doing an objection and refutation, you can write, here is a different solution some other people have proposed, and then refute that solution saying, here's why my solution is better. But otherwise everything else is the same, right? Your intro, hook, three backgrounds, your thesis, your four reasons, objection, refutation, or alternative solution, and why your original is better, and then paragraphs, topic sentences, um, the introduction of the quote using both the author's name and the title each time, the quote and the page number and the explanation for the quote, three backgrounds, four reasons, 
And then of course the objection, right? Or the alternative solution and the refutation and then the conclusion. So by Friday, you should finish your grammar two quiz and I will try and see if I can get a PowerPoint presentation of those corrections. Um, and um, start looking at grammar three's instructions, um, review the note card assignment. I will present a summary on taking notes in a separate video and be looking at the instructions for essay three. Your first typed rough draft for essay three is due online for self-review and you may submit your self-review um, Wednesday the 25th um, by 11.59 p.m. Of course, you can submit your rough draft now um, and do the self-review now. You don't need to wait.